Hi everyone, Happy New Year. Welcome back to my channel. I have a project share for you today, and this one is courtesy of Coffee Cakes and Crafting Facebook group. Uh, Tiffany McGill decided that for the next 52 weeks, she will be posting a project that we can do, and it's supposed to be simple enough for us to do. It's not gonna be complicated, just to help keep the crafty mojo flowing. So this is the first one that she's doing. It's like a folio. And um, let me show you the paper pad that I used before I begin. It is this Mariposa stack. And it is a very beautiful paper pad. It has a lot of gold embossing in it. And the colors in here are absolutely stunning. So I'm going to show you. Uh, you're looking at my cover right now. Um, I did something with this that's a little different. This is the paper that I used for the covers. This side right here I used for the front cover and this side here I used for the back cover. Okay, so that's what you're looking at. And this piece right here came from this right here that I just cut out and backed it with some glitter paper that I had in my stash. And I added this um, sentiment here that says one of a kind. And you can see the sparkly, it is, it is striped. And for my closure, I did use magnets. And they're pretty powerful magnets. Um, they're so powerful that one of them broke. Okay, I had it off to the side here. And did you see that? I mean, I'm not even close to it, and this thing is just all over the place, and it just, and once it hit the pack like that, it broke into three pieces. So you don't want to keep this near your phone or your computer because it'll wipe out all your data. So anyways, so that's what I used, and when you open it up to this side, this is what it looks like. I have magnets here. I really didn't want to cover them up, so, and I figured that the paper did a lot of a lot of the talking for itself so I didn't want to put too much on there plus it's got the gold embossing on it and it's so beautiful and that that carries your eye over to this side of the page here where I have a pocket this is a full sheet of paper that goes all the way down to the bottom and the die that I use for the pocket is this Alina Crafts die right here and I used the largest one so that's the one I used and what I did is I inked up around the edges of it with some distress ink just so it has some definition to it and then for this sheet of paper here I had a scrap left over so I used Martha's which is this one I used that and I punched out the top and the bottom to make a little strip here and then I put a gold ribbon on it I believe I got it from Michaels and then I created a bow for it so that's that and then I took some washi tape and I put it down the side here and it is washi tape of bows and that is this one right here and I think I got this one at Michaels or did I get it at Hobby Lobby Hobby Lobby okay and so this is the other side of it this is the um, where the paper pad goes and let me just take this out for a second so you can see what I did underneath here so what I did was I put this piece of paper down and it also has gold embossing on it and then I took another sheet of paper and I did the band across it that the paper sl pad slides into and I wanted it to match what was already under there so that it was like a continuous picture so I sacrificed another sheet of paper for that which you know wasn't too bad and so that's what I did I just cut that section out and I continued it so there's that and this just slides in here nicely and then the higher up it is that the band is the less likely it is to slide down off of your folio and then I use the same paper up here that I used for the pockets to decorate the paper bag another strip of the washi tape and then the other side so this page right here is the other side of this page right here okay so there's that and here's the back 
and then I put some strips of paper down the spine and this strip here is a continuation of this page right here so there you go this is my folio I hope you guys enjoyed watching this I hope it inspires you to create your own check out coffee cake and crafting Facebook page and get some inspiration uh, Tiffany will be loading up videos every Monday for every week of this year so hope you guys can stop by her channel I'll leave her link below so that you can see the tutorial that she did so you guys have fun have a great day and happy crafting everyone